reverse the reverse scaling thing. What? Look, I'm not that good at emotional multitasking, all right? I'm a little bit upset. All right, all right. Just stay off the public address system, okay? I don't know what good Pickney's gonna be to us. I mean, even if he does get it declared a, a heritage site, it still belongs to Sky. She can sell it to Johnny Shea or whatever other low-life scumbag she wants to. Marilyn, Johnny Shea won't buy it if it's a heritage building. Because if it's a heritage building, he won't be able to haul it down and build his... his slum empire on top of it. Get a grip, Eddie. Oh, you're living in a dream world. Ah! Thank you, Jesus! Howie! Mr. God, Marilyn, he's trying to kill me. Howie, what in the name of... So maybe he's cold-bloodedly trying to murder his own... his own friend of the family. Gee, Mum, we're just trying to get some privacy. In the name of God, you want privacy for at your age. What do you think he wants privacy for, Marilyn? Listen to me, my son. This is not some kind of a flop house, you know? E Eddie. This is not some kind of a low-life love nest. Uh, Eddie! You know Sonia Pickney, do you? Pickney? You're not the professor's young one, are you? Yes. Yes, I am. Nice to meet you, Mr. Hocko. Nice to meet you, Sonia. Welcome. Welcome to this very precious, very old, very heritage building. I hope you enjoy your visit. Where would you get violets in St. John's? Well, that was easy. Declaring this place a heritage site, that's not going to be easy. I'm going to need a lot of detailed information. So if you've got some little time that you could fit me in more fully. I mean, I, I, I've got a, an office, a little place in town that I work. In yeah. town? It's a kind of studio. Like Elizabethan Towers. Oh, like an apartment? Well, it's a working space and an apartment setting. An apartment. Eight o'clock. Uh, Trace? Who's that? That is... Wanda. She was my first serious squeeze, man. Look at this, look, look. Um, Trace, that says Davey. Huh? Oh, yeah, look, look. There you go, look. Huh? Ooh. Huh? She is one excellent babe, man. Yeah. Oh, yeah. She pierced me. Oh, way. Oh, way, my young friend, way. Nose, nipple, and beyond. That is so cool. Oh, yeah, and I lost her, man. I lost her. Now every time I'm out there on that ice and the old nipple ring freezes up, what do I got to think about, eh? What? An office? I don't know, some kind of office in the home thing. Uh, an apartment. I know, I just have to meet him over there at 8.30 to just encourage him to put this place forward as a heritage building. No way, Marilyn. I am putting my foot down. You are not going over there. This thing is getting completely out of hand. It was your idea in the first place. You were the one who said, you know, try to get him to think he could get the... Could get the puck in the net, etc. I never said etc. I know you never said etc. Suddenly, when I'm going along with the plan, you got to go the opposite. Oh, you're always reverse skating, aren't you, Eddie? Sky said she had a meeting with Johnny Shea last night. What? I'm warning you, Marilyn. Do not go to that limey skin hound's muff mansion. Marilyn? Marilyn? So this thing
thing with you and Sonia, man? Is it love? Mm. She sure smells good. Very clean, you know? Uh, yeah. Women who bathe. And I remember them well. So, where and when's it gonna go down? Elizabethan Towers. Tonight. Wait a sec, tonight? No, no, I thought you were doing the music for the figure skating tonight. Eh, uh, no. Scott is doing it. I just gotta go set up the tape, sir. All she has to do is press play. <sighs> you don't have to go over there. She's not gonna sell to Johnny Shea. Who says? She does. She definitely said she wasn't gonna sell to Johnny Shea. Okay. Not definitely. Marilyn, I am literally on my knees begging you not to go over there. Look at me! All right. I won't go over there. You're going over there, aren't you? Uh. Yes, you are. I can tell, Marilyn. Just the way you said I'm not going over there, I know you're going over there! I am begging you on my mother's grave. Your mother's not dead. Just an expression. Hello? Mom? M Mom, are you all right? Oh. Oh, great. Oh, oh, yeah, okay, the uh, blue milk or the black milk? No, Mom, 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 you're, you're not getting the red milk. Do you know how much fat there is in that milk, Mom? Okay. Okay, bye-bye. See that? I just mentioned her name and she calls. She got sonic hearing. What, what is she, Perth Bat? That fatty milk is not blocking up her ears, I tell you that. Marilyn? Marilyn! Where are you going then? Home. Home? Christ. Well, who's gonna serve in the canteen? I don't know, Eddie. Maybe you can, all right? I'm tired. All right, all right. Marry me. M marry me. Please, marry me. All right, Eddie. Let's get married. When? Come on, but Marilyn. Marilyn? Marilyn! Marilyn! Tracy. Tracy, Ma. lend me your car. Hey, you know my policy on that. Listen, Marilyn is leaving me. What? I don't know. She's she's going to meet Pickney at Elizabethan Towers. I've got to try to stop her. Oh, wait. Rewind that tape. I said, please lend me your car. No, 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 no. Pickney, Marilyn, Elizabethan Towers? I said, I've got to go to Elizabethan Towers to try to stop her. Uh, they're doing that now? Yes. Excuse me. Tracy. Tracy! Dear Sky, these are the tapes for the figure skating. They're queued up and ready to go. No! Hey! Sorry, I gotta... I gotta go. Uh, sorry, but you're actually gonna have to drive to Samboni during the championships. Tapes and now the canteen. Marilyn just left sick. Sorry. Uh, uh bye. Bye. Oh, tapes. Tapes. Johnny. Lovely evening. Yeah? First time of year? Mm -hmm. Nothing going on onto the rink? Yeah. The all Newfoundland figure skating. Oh, yeah. What are you doing here? Well, I can say the same thing to you. <laughs> I live here. I'm in the lobby of the building in which I live. Uh, and you're just uh, hanging around in the lobby. Oh, no, 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 no. no. It's Friday night, you know. Just thought I'd come down and see what's on the go. Oh, yeah. Are you following me? Oh, no, no, no. Just on my way to the elevator in the building in which I live. Well, uh, go right ahead. Could you 
not use the bathroom in your apartment, in the building in which you live? Found myself caught short. Working late, Professor. Yes, I've just got a paper to finish for the Learned Society. Uh -huh. and, uh, mm -hmm. Nothing I can help with. Uh, I shouldn't think so, Johnny. No. no. I suppose you will be taking it on the bot. <laughs> oh, tell me I've forgotten the paddle. I suppose that gift store down in the lobby will have some kind of substitute. All right, well, the first of your punishments, Miss Van Rye, will be for the wearing of that suggestively short tunic. Ready in one moment, Mrs. Nosworthy. breaking and entering. Well, like I say the same thing to you. Uh, on the contrary, this is the building in which I live, and furthermore, in which I am part owner. in the home. Bradley! Uh, Adrian. Um, I, I don't know what I'm doing here, but I, I just want to be quite upfront with you about this whole rink heritage thing. It's just that I thought, well, I'm just fed up with the whole routine and always smelling like a deep fat fryer and the, the constant cold and... And violets. I mean, you know, they. What's the matter with you? Go on out there. No. I can't. I just right can't. In the, in the middle of the stink and, and damp of the rink, and I guess, ridiculously enough, I guess I thought that. I sort of thought that you. You, maybe. Coleslaw? What I'll do is uh, I'll put some music on. That's a good idea, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, I should not be getting involved in this, but poor little fellow. I mean, if he's having sex and Marilyn walks in on him, well, it could destroy it all forever. Imagine. And he'd never be able to perform without his mother being in the room. did, yes, of course. I mean, and I'd like to say something to you. I am well aware of your odour, the odour of chips. I mean, you know, 
the symbolic odour in your life, I mean. And I mean, because I, I too, I mean, I, I'm deeply in the fat uh, with Julia. I, I, mean, I mean, I'm talking symbolically here, of course. Noseworthy. Noseworthy. I, I mean, you know, the constant cries for help, the suicide attempts, and. This time of the night. I guess the, the rich have everything. Where are you? I need to talk to you. The ice in this rinky dinky rink is slubby. Slubby? Um, no. No, 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 no. No, 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 Adrian. I couldn't do that. No, no, no. I mean, I could never do that. I. Well, I, I, I guess I, I, I could do it. No, no, no. Should we just uh, no, of forget it? I can never sleep with you now, of course, because I now I'll just be ticking off the days until we get to the paddling phase. I mean, I mean, there's no. What the hell, Johnny? Can't help it. It's not me. Tim, John Jr. I mean, well, I'm a Catholic, and. Oh. And... Whatever he rubs up against, it don't mean nothing. Could be anything. Dog, cat, horse, rat. All right, all right. God, that kind of thing makes me sick. It turns my stomach. But at the same time, I mean, I, I had no idea that I could have that effect on somebody. I mean, not not to say now that I, that paddling is is not normal. I I, mm. I know it's it's very normal for for people with an English education and oh. Uh, Despite your age uh, and your lack of any kind of facial feature, you are an unbelievably attractive man. Thanks, Johnny. You're welcome. I've never uh, I've never been with a. With an Englishman. Ah! Ah! What? what? What do you want? Push your hand in the air. And stand up. Up, 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 up. And turn around. Turn, turn. And, and go back. And get in uh, the closet. Take off his pants. Take off Daddy's what? pants? It'll relieve the pressure on his head. It's a standard St. John ambulance procedure. Yeah, safety first. Come on, yeah, kids, let's get out of here. Come on. So, how is that? Take off his pants. And then he'll think he's after getting it when he wakes up. And then he'll go along with us on the heritage oh, designation. For God's sake. Marilyn, look, 
Put your panties in his hands. No, no, no. Uh, on his head. Right, wait, on his head. It's that easy. No way. They're my good ones. I'm not getting them off. They're silk. What are you doing wearing your good panties over here? I just happen to have it on. Oh, no, you just happen to have them on. Yeah, okay. I just happen no, to have... Baker, all right. I'll haul his pants off, but then that's it, okay? I gotta get out of here. I think my parole officer listened to something. Wait, come on. 